of Philadelphia grieves together after a teenager is gunned down in front of his neighbors. Meanwhile, the shooter remains at large. Out of reporter Trang Dell is live at police headquarters with details on the investigation. Trang. Over Helen Jim, this was a crime witnessed by numerous people, including children who were just hanging out outside when this shooting happened. So police do have a good description of the suspect, but they've yet to make an arrest. We are so sorry for your loss. With tears in their eyes, balloons and candles in their hands, family, friends and neighbors gathered outside of a North Philadelphia home where a 16 year old was gunned down just after midnight Sunday. He was really a special boy, no problems. Very respectful. Very, Very respectful. respectful. Most Very respectful. respectful. Police say the teen was hanging out with a group of children on the 2700 block of North 19th Street when a man with a gun approached and began firing to the crowd. The 16 year old was shot three times. Paramedics pronounced him dead on the scene. This is a pain that we go to bed with. This is a pain. We could wake up with this is a pain that we will never forget. A bullet also struck a 12 year old boy in the leg. He was rushed to Temple Hospital and is expected to recover. I know he was loved. And as neighbors mourn the fallen teen, they also mourn the sense of safety they once felt on this normally quiet block. All they did was play up and down the street, go from house to house, just enjoying themselves as teenagers should do. As they should do, they should be able to play on the block. They should be able to play, they should be able to come outside your house and not have to worry about this. He's in heaven now. And the suspect is described as a light skinned black male with a skinny build, about 5'9, with wavy hair and light eyes. Anyone with information is asked to contact police at 215 686 TIPS. But for now, we're live outside police headquarters. I'm Trang Doe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Jim Verhell, back to you.